Hello, I'm David Kersel, and I'm here to talk about Spraymation's new 311-415-3 vacuum panel mounting bar. These vacuum mounting uh, bars attach to your present magnet bars uh, with a steel back that sticks to the magnets. Each of the magnet bars has a manifold and a number of suction cups which can be used to mount plastic parts or metal parts or whatever you want to mount to the uh, uh, vacuum mounting bar. There are a number of possible locations along each bar. They are spaced uh, one inch apart, 25 millimeters, and they are uh, have interchangeable suction cups and screws. So you can change the spacing to whatever spacing you need for your specific product. Once the vacuum is turned on, plastic parts can be stuck on the various suction cups just by presenting them to the suction cups. These parts can be flat panels or three-dimensional parts like these little boxes. Parts can be put on in, in any order you wish. They can be readjusted once they're on. On. And that's how simple panel loading is. When it's time to take a part off, just grab it and pull it off. There's quite a bit of suction in this device and it can hold uh, something that uh, weighs a little more. Here's an aluminum panel. It works just as easily. It's a very flexible system. You can adjust the number of suction cups that you have and their spacing to conform to whatever your panel size is. If you're using a three-dimensional test substrate, whatever you need, you can adjust it with this. The only thing that you have to be aware of when you're using this is when it is in use, all of the suction cups must be covered. Because if they aren't, the vacuum is going to roll paint in and it's going to clog the orifices in the suction cup device. This is a small Venturi vacuum generator that's been used by this system. It operates on compressed air at about 70 psi by far and uses a little under 2 CFM to generate the vacuum for this vacuum mounting panel with uh, 24 individual suction cups. Anyway, I want to thank you for taking a moment and watching this short video on the new Spermation 311-415-3 vacuum mounting bottle.